Hey there, all you cool cats and kittens. Shout out to T Carol Baskins from Tiger King, if you get that reference. Today, I decided I'm gonna do something with my life and I'm going to bake. Um, yeah, you heard that correctly. So let me just set you up here. Welcome to my kitchen. I have been working from home for two weeks. I'm entering my third week doing school from home. I'm kind of bored. So I saw this recipe on Facebook to make like um, rolls. I don't bake ever. Um, can't hurt to try. Maybe it can, I don't know. Um, this could go terribly wrong, I don't know. So this is my recipe. So yeah. It says to preheat the oven at 350, so easy enough. Let's get started. So the first thing I need is one cup of flour. Is this flour? It's not labeled. Oh no. Oh, flour! One sec, I just got a very important email. Here we go. I'm not very good at um, baking. I don't do it very often. And that is on purpose. I accidentally turned it off. Ah! Hi, welcome back. Now we just need some baking powder and some salt. I'm using my roommate's cooking supplies here. Shelby, shout out to you for being like so prepared. I just need a teaspoon for everything. And this is a half teaspoon. Baking hack. You can substitute one teaspoon for two half teaspoons. Some people don't know that. Salt. A half cup of milk. Milk. That scared me. We are preheated, baby. And then we just need two tablespoons of mayonnaise. Don't know why we need mayonnaise. Mayonnaise grosses me out. Blah. I have this traumatic experience with mayonnaise where one time I like really liked it for a while. Oh, it's on my fingers. Oh, I hope this goes well. By the way, we're finished with the dough. Wow, this actually looks like dough. Did I finish my other story? I went home sick because I had too much mayonnaise and it was gross. Now you're gonna wanna use a muffin tray. Now we're just gonna put some of the dough in each of the little holes. So there's the rolls. So 15 minutes. Um, and we'll see how this goes. So the oven just went off and we're going to see how it looks. They actually don't look that bad. I'm impressed with myself. Okay, they're kind of ugly, but like, they're kind of bouncy. Okay, well, let's get a plate and dive in, shall we? I didn't grease it as well as I thought I did. Feels like bread and smells like bread. Let's try it, shall we? Hold up. That's actually pretty good. I'm gonna turn this into a learning moment really quickly. This quarantine isn't all bad. If it can turn me into a cook, I did put too much salt in here though, I will admit. During this quarantine, when you are stuck at home and you feel down in the dumps, bake some bread from a random Facebook recipe that you saw and you'll feel better by yourself. That's it for today on Cooking with Cami. I might do it again. So send me recipes, send me ideas. I'll do more because I'm stuck at home for the next like month. All right, bye.